The thousands of heads of romaine lettuce behind me will be harvested, boxed, and sent away within the next couple days. But the misconceptions about this specific crop are negatively impacting our local farmers. The greatest misconception right now is that romaine is not safe to eat. No matter how small the sample may have been coming from the West Coast, it seems like it's impugned all of romaine lettuce. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, back in late March, E. coli tainted romaine lettuce from Arizona sickened about 150 people, killing one. The CDC says that it's unclear if there could be other sources still on the shelves. An outbreak from a foodborne pathogen, it has long reaching effects as far as litigation. So people are very cautious to let people know that there may be a problem with this lettuce. But the co-owner of Hensel Farms in Milmay is saying that you don't have to worry about E. coli if you're getting your lettuce from New Jersey, partially because of how it's grown. A lot of the western lettuce is grown in deserts and the water is basically canaled in through canals and in those canals there's the possibility of animals living in there and that's all you need is something there to contaminate the water, and it's a possibility that it could contaminate the lettuce. But Hensel says that pretty much the entire East Coast is irrigated with well water, which is tested multiple times a year. So it really eliminates the possibility of E. coli or any such dangerous bacteria getting into the lettuce. But how do you know it's local lettuce you're getting? Donato says it's simple. Typically, retailers identify the grower on their display, but if not, you can always ask. Every box sent has the grower's name on it, and every box has a unique identification code as well. So, Hensel says wherever you decide to purchase your lettuce, whether it's the grocery store or a local farmer's market here in South Jersey, as long as it's Jersey fresh, it's going to be safe. It's fresh, it's beautiful, it's ready to eat. Get out and please support your local farmer. I'm Nina Contento for SNJ Today.